All right, you guys, so let's see the current message for you guys today. Let's see the current message. Okay, this is like Eight of Swords. So somebody could be trapped in fear about a situation. So somebody could be needing to work on their sacral chakra, okay? Because somebody could be trapped in fear about a situation. Something with 28 or 82. Something with February 28th, August 28th, okay? Yeah, somebody could be trapped in fear or somebody could be in jail too, all right? Is what I'm seeing here. So somebody needs to work on their sacral chakra, all right? But we're going to really get into like why is this Eight of Swords out here, okay, for someone. So on the next clip, we're going to get more into it. All right, so here is the energy. Okay, so we have Pisces, we have Libra, we have Virgo, we have Taurus, we have Sagittarius. So what I'm feeling with this energy is, I feel like that somebody could be, have a hidden agenda. Okay, this person could be very dishonest. Okay, for some of you guys, this could be a person that, um, they could be very selfish and very shallow, okay? I feel like you guys are led or you guys could have went within a situation. And when you do go within a situation, I feel like you're going to close the cycle with this horrifying energy, okay? So somebody is closing out a cycle with um, someone that's married. Um, this could be a performer of some sort, okay? A person that perform on the media, Okay, um, I feel like that somebody could be moving forward to someone else. Okay, so this could be simply as somebody that watches somebody and somebody um, could feel like that somebody has a hidden agenda with who they watch. Um, somebody could feel like that somebody is very uh, unfair and I feel like that somebody is just going to go off and start watching somebody else. Okay, because this is how somebody could feel. Somebody could feel like that whoever that they watch can put them in the um, Eight of Swords kind of energy, very stuck mentality. Um, so somebody is just deciding to watch someone else. Okay, um, of course, if that's how you feel, you know, everybody is not going to vibe with you, you know. Um, just because a person don't vibe with you don't mean that that's not a good person. That's not a good spirit. It just means that that, that particular individual, that spirit is, you know, y'all just don't connect. Okay. Um, it doesn't always mean like a person is evil. You know, sometimes people just, you know, they don't connect. So that's one situation. <clears throat> the other situation I'm hearing, somebody could, um, there could be some kind of misunderstanding in a situation because somebody is really not listening to their intuition. So there could have been a misunderstanding um, when it came to a marriage, when it came to a performer, okay? I feel like that when somebody go within, okay? I feel like that somebody is gonna see uh, progress in a situation um, because somebody could have really doubted someone, okay? This could This could be like even someone's guidance. Somebody could have doubted someone's guidance. Somebody could have felt like that someone uh, was dishonest. Someone could have felt like that someone was ignorant, selfish, um, or whatever. But I feel like that something could have happened and now somebody is willing to listen to you, Queen of Wands, all right? So you could be a Queen of Wands energy. You could be very confident, very vibrant at this time very focused, very determined. I feel like if you gave somebody some advice, somebody could have felt like you was bullshitting, but I feel like now somebody could be wanting to listen because somebody could have went within and investigated something and found out that you was right about a situation, okay? It's also what I'm hearing. This could be somebody that you gave advice to about a situation and somebody thought you was bullshitting and thought you was full of shit. But I feel like that this person is listening to you now. This person could be a Virgo, a Libra, a Pisces, a Taurus, a Sagittarius, okay? Or you could be those signs. Only apply with fit and leave the rest. But that's what I'm seeing with this energy, okay? I'm seeing that um, for, I see Taurus and Sagittarius. 
I feel like that um, strong uh, Taurus and Sagittarius placements is what I'm feeling. Um, I feel like that somebody is going to have a lot of opportunities coming through for whatever that you do that's in this horrifying energy, okay? I feel like that you're going to have a lot of opportunities that come through. So you could be some kind of spiritual leader, teacher. Um, you could be a, a motivational speaker. You could be, somebody may want you to come speak at their school is what I'm hearing. Somebody may get like some kind of invite to go to a school and, um, you know, and talk to the students and stuff like that. You know, you could have a big influence on a large, um, you know, you could have a nice platform and stuff like that. And somebody has really been investigating you and wants you to come speak at their school is what I'm hearing. Somebody is about to get some kind of invitation to be a speaker at some kind of event or I'm hearing at some kind of school or something like that. That's also what I'm getting here. So somebody is getting investigated for uh, a big opportunity as well, okay? This could have been a person that doubted you at first, but I feel like this individual know you the truth and what you speak about, what you do, and somebody, you know, they want to, you know, kind of collaborate with you on something, okay? Is what I'm seeing here, Okay? Also, if you are a model, you are about to have some kind of expansion when it comes to your career is what I'm seeing as well. You're about to have a lot of opportunities that come through for you if you are a model. Okay. Yep. You're going to be moving forward with some uh, opportunities coming real soon. Okay. It could be um, maybe you reached out to a company and it could be, you know, you could be waiting on an answer. Okay, when it comes to a company, maybe to accept you, maybe you're trying to model, maybe you waiting on some kind of answer, okay, to see if you made it, all right, it's also what I'm hearing. So only take, you know, so that was like a few channel, you know, messages, only take what resonate for you and leave what doesn't, okay, but in the next clip, we're going to get some characteristics and some initials as well. All right, so someone could have right arm tattoos. Someone could be pregnant. We have truck, real as fuck. We have mechanic, high cheekbones, long nails. Somebody could be below 5'5". Five five. We have cancer and we have suspense movies, okay? So only take what resonate and leave the rest. All right. All right, and we're gonna get some initials as well. For some of you guys, this has something to do with travel is what I'm hearing too. You may have to travel to something, okay? And you are gonna be in your head about it. Okay, you are gonna be in your head a little bit about traveling when it comes to some kind of like opportunity, okay? All right, so let's get some initials. All right, so here are the numbers and the initials, okay? So we have Aquarius, Taurus, Pisces, Virgo, and Leo, okay? Something with Boston I'm hearing, and I'm hearing Simone, okay? I'm hearing Kimberly, okay? Something with 89, 83, 85, 82, 98, 93, 95, 92, 38, 39, 35, 32, 58, 59, 53, 52, 25, 23, 29, 28. Okay. I'm not really led to really get a whole lot, okay? So I'm just going to leave it there, all right? Like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me with the services that I provide. And with that, you guys, peace and love. I'm hearing Samantha too, okay? I just heard Samantha.
All right. <laughs>